If you've received an email that you believe may be a phishing or extortion scam, one designed to trick you into giving up your login information or paying a ransom, you can safely delete it. But before you do, perhaps you may be interested in sticking it to the bad guys by reporting that email to the authorities. The most effective way to report scam emails is to pass along the full email, including the complete headers. The headers include all the behind-the-scenes details about an email message, including where it came from and how it got to you. Authorities can sometimes use this information to track down or build a stronger case against cybercriminals. First, let's show you how to display the email headers if you're using Apple Mail or the web-based version of Gmail, and then we'll cover where to forward that information. If these instructions go a little too fast, don't worry, you can always pause the video whenever you need to to catch up. This is a scam email that purports to have been sent by the CIA. Check out our video about this specific scam, CIA Porn Accusation Emails. One way you can tell this is a fake is that the from and reply to addresses don't go to a .gov domain. To see the full email headers, click on View, then Message, then Raw Source. You can either copy and paste all this into a new email, or you can save this as a file and attach it to your report. Let's look at the save method. Go to File, Save As, make sure it's somewhere you'll find it, and click Save. Next, compose a new message and address it to the organizations you want to report the scam to. We'll discuss this more in a minute. Add an appropriate subject, then drag the email's raw source file onto the email body, and now you're ready to hit send. Now for the Gmail method of showing email headers. Note that this email is spam, but not necessarily a scam. To see the headers, click on the three vertical dots, then show original. Similar to Apple Mail, you can copy the data to the clipboard, or you can download the email's raw source code as a file and attach it to a report. There are a number of organizations to which you can report an email that appears to be a phishing or extortion scam. You can forward any such email with complete headers to the Anti-Phishing Working Group at reportphishing at apwg.org, and they'll work with a variety of organizations to try to take down the scammer. If you're a U.S. resident, or you have reason to believe the sender might be, or if the email impersonates a U.S. government agency, you can also forward the email to spam at uce.gov to report it to the U.S. federal government. Or if the message is U.S. tax fraud claiming to be from the IRS, send it to phishing at irs.gov. For U.K. tax scams, forward them to phishing at hmrc.gsi.gov.uk. For fraudulent emails that claim to be from Apple, forward them to reportphishing at apple.com. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Comment below on any Apple security topics you'd like us to cover. And share this video with your friends if you think they might find it helpful too. And if you want the world's best Mac protection software on the market, New customers can save 50% by going to intego.com slash buy now and using the coupon code intego YT at checkout.